now it don't taste quite as bad. The beer doesn't taste as bad? Now my, my taste buds have gotten a little better now. Oh, why do you think that happened? <laughs> Did you? We had to have a moment of silence. The Did post office? Up? Can you? It's here. Oh, why did you do that? The sun was right in my eyes. Oh, I didn't know. Uh, I'm not sitting exactly where you are. A moment of silence. For what? What's the silence for? <laughs> Don't want to piss off the postal employee. So. The guy, one guy in Ohio, or somewhere in Ohio, uh, walked into his uh, post office and just shot his supervisor in the head. Then got in the car and drove to another supervisor's house and shot her in the head. So why would I, uh, I still think that? Don't piss me off. And he did it naked. Naked? All the time? Yeah. Well, he wasn't playing at living, was he? I don't know. I, I made, don't know what they did to him. Well, he, may, he might have taken his own life. I, I, I didn't hear. Most people that do things like that usually take their own life instead of waiting for the cops yeah. and everything. I mean, you're killing a federal employee. This is one of the those guys in college basketball. Oh, yeah. That's what he did. They, I mean, they do drive you nuts. They're on you every single day. Then they come out and watch you and dance and dance. It's like, you know, you might, you might have got, uh, you might have got fired for doing something really stupid. And he's taking revenge on the supervisor that, that fired him. Well, what did he do? I don't know. He shot and killed two people. Oh, I mean, what did he do to, to lead up to that, maybe? Yeah, know. what's that incredibly stupid thing he did? He shot and killed two people. You mean you're not meaning to say he was fired for? You wouldn't know. just be I don't, fired. We don't know if he was fired. If you shot and killed two it's, people, it's, you I wouldn't just I, be fired. It's, it's in here. Wait and see if he had a registered handgun. He probably did. He, Twenty, like twenty-eight years old. Let me see. All oh, right here. You got it. List of postal killings. Yeah, enraged naked postal worker goes on killing spree. Oh, Columbus, Dublin, Ohio. <laughs> this guy. Yeah. You're on video, Bill. Oh, race doesn't matter. No, but I'm saying he's African American. Correct? Yeah, the picture does look African American. I mean, people are going to commit crimes no matter what color their skin is. If he was white, I would have said he was white. Or Caucasian. Yep, Caucasian is the technical term for a white person. F I was about to say African American. Uh, I don't think you can call all. You can't call all black people African American, right? I'm. I mean. Is there any other country that they would come from that you would call them that? They're from Africa. Yeah, but not all, but not all Africans are in America. There are there are Africans in European countries. Well, that's where they relocated. Yes. So you call them, you technically call them Africans then, right? I mean, I white people are called Caucasians. That's the technical term. So I'm assuming that the technical term for a uh, black person would be Caucasian. I mean, I mean African. Sorry, that was a, a slip there. I meant to say African the first time. 
When I didn't see why. When I was growing up, they were they were called uh, they were called Negroes. Uh, yes. Uh, and and 40 years later, they wanted to be called black. Blacks. Yeah, I, yeah, I remember the era of that, slavery, that Jim. Through the, through the decades. Yes, uh, I've I've heard it all. The era of slavery, Jim Crow, civil rights, and all that. Rosa Parks, Martin Luther King. Parks, yes. Yeah, I've I've heard all that. It was down in Alabama. What? What? Rosa Parks had situation I think occurred down in, in Alabama, or no, or maybe Mississippi. Well, maybe Mississippi. And then there was that. Then there was that protest or march on in Selma, Selma, Selma uh, where the police were pretty violent. A violent, a violent time in life. A violent time in life? Yeah, because primarily the South was yeah. for his wife. Oh, oh they got the basketball game here. Yeah, you know what? Yeah. Yeah. How's the raspberry tie? How's your teeth? My teeth, my the tea is good. You didn't squeeze your lemon into it. I could eat the lemon if you want. Acidity, maybe not. You're right. That that would be a bad idea. It's said to avoid yeah. acidic stuff. However, that was not before I kind of bit into it and released some juice, so... Oops. Did somebody like, uh... Penn State. Penn State? I was looking for Pittsburgh. Penn State. Yeah. They're Trinidad and now see how good they are. And he's deceased. Joe Paterno? Uh, say, Bill, what do you think of affirmative action? I mean, no comment. If they want, no comment on that. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna delve into that. We once talked to, we once discussed affirmative action in my intro to ethnics class. I'm all for preventing discrimination. I'm pretty sure. Thank you. Thank you. Harris, would you like another drink at all? Same thing? Okay. I'm all for anything that'll prevent discrimination, and I'm pretty sure everyone is. No one wants to be discriminated against, and nobody wants well, people know. to be discriminated I against. I thought you were for him. I He's getting mac and cheese, too. You want one or no? Sure. I didn't know what they were. But use your fork, Tom. They're frogies. Sure, Aren't these finger foods? Yeah, but put it on your plate, Ty. Right? Oh. You you ordered I thought you were gonna eat these as a supper. But... Yeah, they're an appetizer. I'm sure I'll have plenty of food. I don't have to have one. Oh thanks. You just pick it up, guys. Got it. Thank you. So wait, don't you just pick them up and dip them in the sauce? Well, you can, or you can put it on. The sauce on. You can, but I'm going to put mine on. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to uh, take half. Or can I have the? Or can I have this one? You got two. You can have that pierogi. I'm just hold on, Tom. I'm just going to take some of this. Want sauce, Bill? No, thank you. There you go. Then you can have that. Thank you.
How was it, Bill? It's good. Yeah, these progies are good. They got a nice savory taste to them. Hot, hot or not? For those who know what really No, they're not too hot at all. Some difficulty chewing, but I can eat fine. Take smaller bites. That's probably the way to go. What do you think of affirmative action, Dad? I don't know, I guess it's alright. It's gotta go both ways. I'm in support of it, too. For my face, right? Although my face isn't very messy. Face, Whatever, right? Yeah. Do you think these were frozen or made fresh air? I don't. They're, they're damn good. They are good, yeah. Yeah, they are good. I mean, I had, um, at that Polish place, Polish Chata, I had their fried throat. They were good, too. But I think I like these better. Yeah, these are some good brogy. Again, I'm all for anything that that'll prevent discrimination because nobody wants to be discriminated against and nobody r really wants anybody else to be discriminated against. You know what I mean? And so what are we going to do with the sauce? <laughs> you can keep it and put it on your um, mac and cheese. Okay. I can, I can probably eat about 20 of those things. Oh, there we go. <laughs> 20 <laughs> progies? Yeah, they were good. I'm sure 20 will probably fill you. If they don't, then there's something wrong. They were good. There's like potato, cream cheese, and cheese. They were light, too. Yeah, I, I didn't... Uh, Oh, I, what? Did, I didn't taste any potato. Well, there's potato. Well, oh, what's wrong? That's what a pierogi is. I know, but that, <laughs> not, not always. Not always. They were very same. good. Uh, uh, thank you. Well, oh, what's wrong? What? Well, what's wrong if twenty don't fill you up? Well, I said something should be wrong if twenty can't fill you. Huh. It means you got to really be. Yeah, there's potato. I can taste it. Yeah, yeah, I just taste it. I just tasted the cheese. Twenty probably wouldn't fill me up, but I definitely wouldn't be hungry after that. He did a burger challenge. He's done two burger challenges. I didn't actually complete them. Yeah, he didn't complete them. 
But I took on two burger challenges and did pretty well on them. You had to eat the bun and everything? And french fries. Yeah, I, I ate the bun and everything. I ate the whole burger, but by the time I did, the fries were cold, so I didn't want to eat the fries. So then you lose. Yeah. But one, he had to eat a burger. The burger was like that big. Fries and onion rings and a milkshake. So I guess you got to eat everything. I did eat everything. I did together. You can't eat anything separately. But there was no milkshake and there were no onion rings. What about the first one? The first one. Didn't you have milkshake? You had to finish the milkshake. Yeah, had a milkshake. Then he he didn't finish. And then he wanted ice cream after that, too. I got that ice cream, but I couldn't finish the ice cream. Imagine why. <laughs> yeah. Did you have to pay any money to enter this contest? Well, he had to pay the full $35. If he would have finished, the meal would have been free. But if you didn't, then you got to pay $35. So the only part you didn't finish was the fries? Well, you could have gulped them down for 35 bucks. I would have gulped them down colder than that. Put a lot of ketchup on it. You well, want there's... Like the cold part. Well, there's technically a time limit on the killer yeah. burger. You have, you have like 40 minutes. So you got to eat everything. No, you have an hour for the killer burger. It just didn't everything. say so on the menu. You got to eat everything all at the same time so one thing doesn't get set aside and then there's no good cold. Right? All right. A lot of mustard and ketchup on it and wolf them down. Probably should have ate the fries first. Eat everything all at the same time. Bite, bite here, bite here, bite there, bite here. They were doing that on television. And, uh, well, let's get the facts straight. For the yeah, first... Get the facts straight, Jack. If I facts are fine. I had, I had 40 <coughs> minutes... I had 40 minutes and I was later given an extra five minutes for the Blue Wolf Bistro Burger Challenge. And I didn't know there was a time limit for the Killer Burger Challenge at Tavern Night. Well, it didn't say so on the menu. Where did you, what you found out later? Yeah, one of the servers told us that there's usually a one hour time limit. That's something you ask the next time in the beginning. Okay. Right? Right. How much time do I have for all this? You don't like the time? Say forget it. But was a burger is good. If you don't like the time, you try it anyway because it's all about having you having fun, right? Making new experiences, making memories. True, but you would have rather had the money in your pocket than that if you didn't like the. Mm, the sauce. I didn't. I didn't take them. Oh, this, oh, this is good marinara is sauce. One, yeah, this yesterday or two days ago, we went to Brockport to eat, and then the other time was uh, oh, and then, oh, one time was in the in um, Park Ave or no, yeah, Park Ave, and Tyler sang the the karaoke afterwards, and Tyler uh, was singing and. Uh, uh, some hot blonde came up to him and says, uh, you, you sing here, you sing pretty good and dance pretty good. And Tyler was dancing with her and singing with her. Look at you. Man. You're a hottie. Well, he's a Mackie. <laughs> uh, she, she, goes, she goes to him, are you coming back? <laughs> maybe, maybe one day, maybe. There's so many places to go to. I, I, I got. I, I used to get a girl's name and put her name on a napkin. Napkin. The next day I looked at the napkin and I said, "Where did I get this from?" Oh boy. Uh oh. Say, so, uh, are you going to be using the marinara sauce for anything? You, you can use it. It's yours. You just, you just ate his. I know. Ate yeah. some of it. It's yours, Tyler. Hmm. I I hear I hear tomatoes can reduce the risk of getting cancer. Oh yeah, better eat a lot of pasta. Thing is, you got to eat ten or twelve of them a day. Tomatoes and uh, salt, pretty good. Salt? You say salt? Salt? Oh, Hold on. Oh, well, that makes tomatoes up. Or, or you can slice a tomato, put some uh, fresh mozzarella on it, or cheddar and mozzarella, 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 and uh, bake it. Yeah, that's some good nice marinara sauce. Mushroom and uh, tomato and mozzarella, some sauce, bacon, you're good to go. 
You can see this a lot. A three-man rush for Washington. McSorley knows he has some time and a good job by Kasicki uncovering the rough middle for a big pickup. So all these small classes are all uh, are all uh, no, that whole thing is crash. Yeah. Right. yeah. yeah. You're, you're paying, you're paying, you know, they got this whole place up here that I saw that's another bar. And it's like, they're like a seven ounce or six ounce. Yeah. And you're paying $30 for the whole thing. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I'll break them. I can. Okay. You got ten thousand and twenties on me. See if anybody sells it. Ten thousand and ones. Oh, and twenties. I know. I heard. There's no ten thousand bill. No, I said I got ten thousand dollars and twenties in my pocket. Oh. Really? Yeah. So why would you bring that many twenties? It's right here. Looks like ones. Those, those it's on the outside. That's my Michigan bankroll. Should be the other way, where you have the twenties on the outside and ones in the middle. Oh, pretty good mac and cheese. Does it get any in your teeth? No, I'm okay. You have to gargle, don't you? What do you mean, gargle? Mouthwash. Mouthwash. Oh, yeah. I better... <laughs> yeah. I should probably brush home, my teeth when I get home. Don't want any more cavities. Or any more trips to the dentist for, for having any mistakes. Mm -hmm. So far, so good. Mm -hmm. Another, another okay. Tyler, you want a water? Oh, yeah, I would like some water, please. Thank you. You know, Dad, you're not very observant, are you? Why? You missed something. Oh, no. All right. Well, I didn't see it. What is it? This piece of bread here. Hmm. It goes slow. Somebody will eat it. It feels softer here. Excuse me. On the inside, it's softer, Kyle. Oh, it's the crust. Seems okay if you take it takes small bites, maybe. Mm. Oh wait, I can't use this straw. You want this straw? Do you want it, Bill? All right. I like the blue cheese. I like it better than uh, Murphy's Law. Uh, do you think I can try the blue cheese? I might like it this time. You got something to uh, use your fork yeah, or that? Yeah, I got something right here. Hmm. Oh, the blue cheese was. I actually like the blue cheese this time. Maybe it's the bread. It's got a relishy taste to it. <laughs> It's on that spectrum between relish and mayonnaise.
I see first <laughs> What flavor is that? Caribbean jerk. It's actually very good. And they grill them. They usually jerk a little bit more burn. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you.